Jazz. <laughs> Man, I don't know who you think you are, but... Damien? Yes, Brinster, it is me. The man who runs the show behind the show. Listen, Brinster, I'm a very understanding man, but I do not like having millions of dollars stolen from me right out from under my nose. Listen, man, I didn't do anything. Do not lie to me, Brinster. Do not lie to me. We both know you have done enough of that tonight, and I especially do not like having things stolen from me and then lie about. I think you have the wrong guy. I don't just flat out steal money from people. I do gamble quite a lot, but I don't steal. You have two weeks to bring me twenty million dollars. Well, Mr. Brinster, you don't steal. Let's see about that. <coughs> Where did the extra money come from? Interest. <laughs> Whatever's in it, I'll get it to you. I think you know. Uh, yeah. So Trevor, you uh, thinking about going to the casino tonight to uh, make some easy money? Nah, I don't, I don't fool with tonight, dude. Well then, why are you out here in 40 to be with it? It's got a lot on my mind. Okay. Uh, Miss Anthony, about time you showed up. Yeah, well, it couldn't be such a good opportunity. Opportunity for what? Opportunity to get some money. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Did you see the look on that guy's face when he lost all those chips? Yeah, man. Hey, here. Hey, look, that's like a shortcut. <laughs> I told you it was... Uh, oh. Where's my money, Brinster? Hey, I don't have it. You have five days. Whoa, 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 whoa. what's going on? Hey, hey, don't, don't worry about it, right? Don't worry about it. Don't five days. So, how exactly do you plan to get $20 million in five days? I have no idea. My original plan was to gamble for more money. That's what got me into the situation in the first place. Is there any other way? Probably. You just have to find it. You have a bank account? Right. How may I help you? I need to see Commissioner Dan Higgins right away. See that Trevor kid that he always talks about? That would be me. Right down that hallway, all the way at the end, take a left. Who is it? Trevor Brinster. Come in. So, what can I do for you today? It's about Mr. Clark. Well, Mr. Clark, he's on to me. He's been a play on this city for years. The crime rate since he's been in business has skyrocketed over the years. We were at a casino downtown, just having a good time, and all of a sudden, he took me down to the basement and interrogated me. He told me that I need to pay him $20 million in two weeks. Oh no, you were gambling? You're an ex-cop! If the public found out you were a gambling addict, all hell would break loose! What? Me? Gambling? No, no, I don't gamble. My friend does, however. That must have been why he thought I cheated. What will happen if you fail? He didn't say specifically. I asked him and he said, I think you know. I got a reminder in my bedroom wall last night. It said three days. You are staying the night at my place.
Well, make yourself at home. Nice place. Uh, I did it myself, for the most part. I'll tell you, you'll be fine here. It's one of the safest neighborhoods in the whole city. Judging from the past two weeks, I'm very encouraged. What of the kid? He's staying at Commissioner Higgins' house. Ah. It would appear Mr. Brinster is afraid, as well as the Commissioner. We should give him a reason to fear us. So is it just you here? It's just me. No girlfriends? Wife? I had a wife, but she died in a car crash three years ago. Oh, I'm sorry. No, no. It's it's okay. So, what about you? Anyone in your life? I'm married to my work. That's what a real cop would say. Are they gone? Yeah, they're gone. I just got this window replaced. Jason! Jason, are you here? What? Oh, what are you doing here, man? Good name, Commissioner. Where am I? I wouldn't worry about that. What do you want with me, Mr. Clark? Nothing except information. About what? Why are you helping? Winston, you know it comes at great risk to you, and I will not be hindered in my mission. I have goals, I have deadlines, I have expectations, and you will not get in the way of them. You think you run this city? I do run this city! This isn't about a game of poker anymore, is it? It was never about a game of poker, Commissioner, and you know that. Commissioner, Commissioner, you alright? Yeah, I'm all good. He gives a hell of a scare back to Commissioner. What the heck is going on here, man? How did this happen? I don't know. 
I guess Mr. Clark has more influence <laughs> on the city than I thought. Oh, this is bad. You don't say. How can we fight against such relentless evil? You know what we can do? We can fight. How? We're locked up in more voters from the This is bad. You, where do your allegiances lie? With the corrupt? With the evil? What are you doing? I'm afraid we have no choice. He's taking control of the city and the government. We're only the few who opposed us. What can we do? You can fight. That's what you can do. Take the city back. Well, if it isn't Mr. Brinster. How are you liking your new home, Mr. Brinster? Listen, Brinster, I told you I run this city. I will bring order to a city of liars and thieves. You won't get away with this. I already have. Listen, Mr. Clark, and you listen good. I will not yield to your demands or succumb to your will. I am the master of my own fate, and you will not run this city or my life. I will come down in a rain of fire and terror, and I will end you. Mark my words, I will end you. Okay. Good evening, Springfield. My name is Damian Clark. I am your salvation. Long have you suffered at the hands of these liars and thieves, but now I have come to bring a new order. What do you plan to achieve in all this? Rinster, how did you escape? You don't run this city. There's two people that stand for all that is good in this world. Let's not forget this started. A poker game. I had this planned long before the poker game. I just picked that as an opportune moment. You do realize this land in your demise, right? The National Guard will be here soon. We'll have a tough time getting here after I've blown up all of the bridges. And as all of your bridges are- Are you Bane? And no, I am not Bane! Well, Bane already did this first! Shut up! Turn, 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 turn. We gotta go, we gotta go. I'm not gonna make it, man. Yeah, you gotta go, no. come on.
Trevor was the savior of the city. He stood up for all people crying for help. He was the greatest example of a human striving for justice. But do not cry because he was gone. Be happy he was here for as long as he was. He is an example for this city. When his statue is finished, all will know about his great deeds. I am proud to call him not only my friend, but my brother. I am proud to know that when my children and their children see his statue, they will know about this great man.